to the Osagove YouTube channel. My name is Sam, back again for another video. This time we are here for the Osagove Not So Pub Quiz. Freddie, you're looking very happy there. Uh, we have got four rounds, 20 questions. They're going to be general knowledge, football, music and boxing. I'm just going to unmute all these lots so they can start talking and we will get on with it. Fantastic. Please. Introduce well, yourselves. Doesn't even work. Right. Round one. General knowledge. Number one. Which royal marriage took place on the 29th of April 2011? Oh, come on. <laughs> uh, the <laughs> <laughs> Suck it off already. Has everyone got their answer? <laughs> is, is, is Diana the right answer? No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to ask. I'm going to go around everybody and ask. Alright, okay. Curtis, what did you write? I put Princess Kate and Prince William. Ellis. Uh, Kate and Will. Freddie. Yeah. I support Kate and Will. Chris. I said Kate and Will. Ashley. I said Kate and Will. And that is the correct answer. Oh, I'm actually going to get There's one out of five, boys. One out of five. The second question for all, for all you sea lovers out there. Which is the largest member <laughs> on top? I can see I can see what are you looking at me for? You killed me off as well. I could just see you winding up something to say. <laughs> Right. What is the largest oh. member of the mammal family? This is going to take forever. Exactly. Uh, uh, can you, can you question, please? Uh, what is the largest member of the mammal family? Ash is definitely Google in the Arsenal's Xbox. Um, I don't think I am. I'm not even on Xbox. You fast fraud. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, can we confirm oh. something? Well, well, actually, tell a lie. Look at this. I am. Well, What's that again, sorry? No, 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 no. no, 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 no. no, 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 no. Just, just the mammal family, innit? Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. No, I'll give you a couple of seconds and then we'll move swiftly on. I know, I just guessed. Curtis. I think I got this wrong, but I really don't care. Curtis, I'll what are you saying? I'm not sure what's I put a big blue whale. Ellis. Uh, elephant. Freddy. I said before. What for all sea lovers? <laughs> Freddy. Freddy, what are you saying? What did you put? I also put the blue whale. Uh, Christopher. I just said whales because I didn't notice any bloody whales. Ashley Marie Jensen, what are you putting? <laughs> I put whale. Uh, the people that put whale, you're all correct. Get in. Um, the elephant, unfortunately, is not a sea, uh, not a sea. mammal. So I'll give whale. <laughs> Number three. Who was the fourth president of the US of A? <laughs> Jack, if you're watching this, 
They're loving it, by the way. Ah, piss off. There's no chance I got this right. Um, fourth. Yeah, the fourth president of the United States of America. I'm not even sure if this guy's a president. Oh my gosh. You, you may not, actually. We'll go with Curtis first. I put Lincoln. Ellis. I didn't know, so I put uh, Prince Andrew. <laughs> Freddie. <laughs> I put George Washington. Chris. I didn't know, so I put Pablo Escobar. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Ash. I also put Abraham Lincoln. Uh, he actually plays for Leicester now. It's James Madison. So you're all wrong. Oh, get shot. What was the name of Michael Jackson's pet monkey? <laughs> ah, oh, I read this the other day. Remember, this is general knowledge, so you're meant to know this. Uh, oh, what monkey? It's got to be Curious George. <laughs> <laughs> so what is the name of Alexa. MJ's pet monkey? <laughs> if you like this question, you're going to love the next one. I can't put that, that's going to sound racist. Oh my lord. You're not recording on you. Curtis, what are you saying? You are recording on me. I put Billy Jean. Ellis. Uh, Banjo. Freddie. I put Sean Braggon. <laughs> Chris. Jeffrey. Uh, Ash. I'm going to pass on saying my answer. <laughs> <laughs> Um, as, as you all uh, got wrong, it's uh, Bubbles. That's Fantastic. And the best question and last question of the round, what is the nickname of Anne Hegarty on the ITV's quiz show, The oh, Chase? Oh, 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 no, you can't <laughs> say that word. <laughs> oh, what is it? Um, oh, I don't even know what it is. So what is the na- nickname of Anne Hegarty on ITV's <coughs> quiz show, The Chase? Um, I don't know this as well, I should know this. Oh, no, I put the wrong one down. Oh, um. oh I should know this. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Um. Tough one. Well, we know it's not the best question. Not the Dark Destroyer, and it's not the Beast. (laughs) Uh, Well, it's not this one then. I'm glad we've whittled it down. Please. So, uh, Curtis. I have it. The Cook. Did you, Ellis, what did you put? Sorry? I put the Dark Destroyer, but it's not. Freddy. The Whale. Chris. Mountain. <laughs> Ash. Frosty Nickers. I'm pleased to uh, inform you that you're all wrong. Uh, it was the governess. Oh, the governess! No, oh. there's two. Do you not think does, does old Frosty Nickers have the answer? Right, moving on, round two. Round two. It's going to be. Right, number one. Who is La Liga's all-time top goal scorer? Uh, Mine, Anne, maybe. Uh, wait, what? What league? 
La Liga, so the Spanish league. Who's the top scorer of all time in the Spanish league? Has everyone got it? Curtis. I put Messi. Uh, Ellis. I put Messi. Freddie. I also put Messi. Chris. Yeah, I put Messi. Ash. I also put Messi, but I think he might be wrong. Well, you're all correct. It is, in fact, Lionel uh, Messi. I'll stop between him and Ronald. So the the second question. Which Spice Girl did David Beckham marry? Mike. I actually had this in my, que- my head in the shower earlier because I was like, oh, I wonder if it's a good question. Thanks, Jack. I love you. What were you thinking of? <laughs> what were you thinking about in the shower? Thinking about Jack in the shower. I'm, I'm glad we're talking about the ongoings of Ashley Stane's showers. Mike. That's going to leave Stane. Never mind Sam Gunn's talks. It should be Ashley Stane's shower thoughts. <laughs> It's Freddie, we're talking about baths. So, Curtis, which Spice Girl did David Beckham marry? Victoria. Yeah, I put Victoria. No, hang on. Yeah, go on. There, there's certain rules to this, so you can't. You can't, I won't give Victoria. You've got to have. Thank you. Thank you. Victoria Spice. Posh Spice. Whoever put like Posh Spice is right. Yeah, thanks. Sorry, what? Posh spice. Posh spice. Victoria counts. <laughs> it doesn't. Matt, was she in what Spice Girl with Victoria Beckham? What posh spice? Sp- wait, what? Which Spice yeah, Girl? Spice. I still want it. It is Double. right, but. It's just like saying. Right, I'm going to have a word with Jack after this. I'm getting no, these up. I'm getting these up. <laughs> you crack on, mate. Georgia <laughs> Marshall, Anne Hegarty question. I could have just said Anne Hegarty because that was a nickname. <laughs> I could have said Anne Hegarty and theoretically I've been wrong. I'm living. We don't know what I'm mm-hmm. It could be Big Heggers. When, when we're done. <laughs> <laughs> For how many days did Brian Clough manage Leeds United? 4,600. What the f***? How many days Brian did Brian Clough manage Leeds United? And can this one be the closest wins? Uh, yeah, yeah. Leeds, 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 Christopher Underwood oh. was off by two. Oh, Forty-four days. So I think he's one of the lowest uh, managers in terms of days in oh, the managerial you ring. Um, and also, <laughs> for all you um, Welsh Cup lovers, uh, who were the first winners of the Welsh Cup? Um, that's what I was thinking. And it's not GR Osagovo. Oh, wait, the World Cup these days, or Welsh Cup? Welsh Cup. So the See, Welsh Cup. Swansea and Cardiff count, because they play in... One detail I don't. They can count, but that that may not necessarily be the what answer. Welsh teams? Oh. You know what? I didn't think there was any other team in Wales other than Swansea and Cardiff, to be honest. Oh, no, 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 sure. oh, no, I know, I know, I know. I put one down, but I'm not sure if it's in Wales. <laughs> Brilliant. It's, it's right. close to Wales. Curtis. <laughs> Sorry. I did put... You can't say that, Curtis, Curtis. That's kind of Unfortunately, they're not a club, but... I put, I put Newport. Good guess. Ellis? Uh, Wrexham. Freddie. I put Cardiff. Don't know. Chris. I said Barry. <laughs> Ash. I said Real Town. Ellis. Bang on. Wrexham. Oh, he's coming out. <laughs> so You're bang on. Get shot. He's back in the game, boy. Are you all keeping scores? Yeah. 
Yeah. yeah. yeah. No. I was gonna say because I'm I'm just a host here. I'm not freaking scores. Well, you should, Sam, mate. You should know by now. Yes, Sam. Come on. Number five. Who scored the first Premier League goal ever? Period. Oh, this is watching the video. This Ash was also thinking about this in the show. <laughs> I was. I was. Um, if you've done the first like Premier League winners, I don't know. It's stuck between two. First Premier League goal. I actually don't know. I think I, I mean, think I watched the video on this. Other day. As much as you may think it was Troy Deeney, it wasn't him. Who? Troy Deeney hasn't scored this season, has he? He scored like four. <laughs> Have have we got a guess? So we'll start at the bottom this time. Ash, have you got an answer yet? I've got Les Ferdinand. Oh, uh, Chris. No, that's a great show. It's not, but... What have you got, Chris? I think I know who it is, to be fair. But... I said Letitia. Yeah. Uh, Ellis? I put Samuetto. <laughs> First Premier League ever goal, and you're so Samuetto. <laughs> Freddie. <laughs> Freddie. Freddie, what are you saying? I said Les Ferdinand. And Curtis. I said Teddy Sheridan. It was, in fact, Brian Dean. Samuetto. Close. And there was actually a thing about it, that it was either Alan Shearer, Brian Dean, or Les Ferdinand, and they were arguing about it. So, Unagi... Who knows? We'll leave it to the adjudicators to we'll sort that out. The naughty man. Round three. Music. Uh, Number one. One of the best bands in the world. What was the name of Liam Gallagher's debut album? What, just him? Or just Liam, Liam Gallagher. Gallagher. So not Oasis, just Liam Gallagher. Okay. Sorted. Curtis. <clears throat> I put Rolling Stone. Ellis. Laughing as ever for. Huh? As you were. Freddie. Um. Didn't put anything. Don't know. Chris. I literally got no clue. Ash. As you were. Both Ash and Ellis are correct. As you were. Uh, Ellis has got the album, that's why he knew it. Same, actually. And I've been to see him, Liam Gallagher, three times. Next question. The best ever owner of a football club, uh, Elton John, what is the best se- selling single in the UK by Elton John? What was the song? That's what you've got to find out. I had this question on the quiz last week. Done. And actually, I've helped you out a little bit because Elton John was in the answer. So it's actually just a song you need. I think I know this because I'm pretty sure you play it before you go. (laughs) We play many Elton John songs before we go out. I can't think of any Elton John songs. Renegade Master. I'm the scene saviour. <laughs> um, Curtis. I put Rocket Man. Ellis. I'd have put nothing. Not a big Elton John fan then, no? I don't think many people are, but carry on. Freddie. <laughs> I also put Rocket Man. Uh, Chris. I said Tiny Dancer. He's probably wrong there, actually. Ashley. I've got Rocket Man. It was, in fact, Candle in the Wind. Uh, that's cool. But that's funny, funny fact, Rocket Man 
when it actually come out, was sung at half time by Watford, and they all gave out hymn sheets. It was actually quite sad from our club, to be fair. So, who claimed to be more popular than Jesus? No, it wasn't Wait, Freddie Buck. It was an actual Christian band. Version? So, number three, who claimed to be more popular than Jesus? Well, well, was that from him, Jesus or Jesus, Jesus? Like, as in Jesus, God's Jesus. Oh, Ralph Jimenez. Oh, God, here we go. <laughs> Do I have to cut this out or not? Ralph Jimenez is not real. <laughs> Hang on, I'm just picking my flag back up, boys. So, yeah, it was a band. I, I'll tell you if you want. It's a band, did you It was a band? It was a band that said they were more popular... Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. I wouldn't know because I got Kanye West. So. Oh, I said Soldier Boy. <laughs> Soldier Boy. Oh, can I change my answer? I have yeah, Kanye yeah. West. Because you all thought it was a singular person, so. No, I've, I've, wait, haven't said mine yet. No, I, I haven't asked anybody yet. I'm just I'm waiting oh, for yeah, people sorry. to like. Questions yeah. This? So this is question three. Who no, claimed no, to be more no, popular no, than no, Jesus? No, band. No, no, no. Popular. I think I might have a good chance here. Still got an It was easier to have a fun back when you had Curtis. Arctic Monkeys. Ellis. Nirvana. Freddy. Chris. Queen. Ooh. Ash. I had uh, Pink Floyd. You've all got different answers, and you are all in fact wrong. It was the Beatles. Oh, you. We used it. Number four. Which song was sung by Tyson Fury after his most recent fight? Oh. Um... It's good. It's a good song. He sang it to his wife, and then everyone got involved. It's got to be um, Sam Chinnery. Lose yourself. Did anybody see Tyson Fury's brother when he went? What do you think? And then nobody said anything back. Oh no! I think I think I might got this wrong. So have I. I'm not too sure. Oh, no, I know this guy sung it after one of his fights. I've watched the fight as well. Can we uh, get extra points if we tell you who actually hasn't sang it? Or not? Uh, no, I'm going to say no because I don't know it myself. Okay, no, that's a fraud. The definition of a fraud. <laughs> Fraudiola. I don't know if I know if I've got the song name correct, but I know what the. Um, Sorry. Can you start with me, please? I'm yeah, gonna I'm going to start with Ash this time. Do you want to start with me? Yeah, I actually am going to start with you this American time. American Pie. Freddie. I also put American Pie. Chris. Yeah, I said the same. Ellis. Somewhere Over the Rainbow. <laughs> Curtis. I put, I put American Pie. Everyone, apart from Ellis, is right. <laughs> <laughs> Right, Last one of this round. In the song on, A Day in the Life, how many holes were there in Blackburn? What? Say that in English? In the song A Day in the Life, how many holes were there in Blackburn? I don't even know what that song is. There's probably quite a few holes in Blackburn. I'm just going to confirm I don't know the song either. You've just got to guess how many holes there are in Blackburn. Well, well all the pot holes. Is it, is it close as Windsor? Yeah, I would have guessed so, yeah. Just go with that. I'm going to think this might be right, but I'm, again, I'm probably wrong. We'll start with Ellis. This number was also a, a lowest appearance in League One, so I'll let you know. 
Alice, what are you saying? Six. Freddie. Sixty nine. Curtis. Eight. Chris. Forty two. Ash. Four thousand. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Ash has just got it right. <laughs> Don't even chat to me. Like, Ash has just got it right. Oh my life. John Lennon. Peace to, peace to you and your family, bro. What? Did he get it spot on? Spot on. Isn't that spot on? Bad nah. man. Spot You're on. You're a bad man. John Lennon. Peace to you, mate. Love that. <laughs> my, my, my broski. Fuck. <laughs> Final round is boxing. For all you boxing oh, fans out there. Mikey. So, yeah, this, this is for tribute for Michael McKinson. Apart, so, number one. Number one. Apart from orthodox, what is the other main stance? So I'm guessing the stance is that. Yeah, what? I actually used to box, so. You actually look like a boxer as well, man. Watch out, Mikey Mickinson. <laughs> Big Ash is coming for you. Oh, I've got five questions, sorry. <laughs> yeah, man, let's <laughs> Freddy's looking to suck it off, early doors. <laughs> so, apart from orthodox, what is the other main stance? I'd actually love to scrap Mikey, just, just to put it out there, calling you out here on the YouTube channel. Oh, my life. Let's have it. <laughs> Bearing in mind he's the So, Ash, what did you put? South Pole. Where's my face gone? Ellis. Uh, left, right, good night. <laughs> <laughs> Freddy. Yes, my Freddy. What was your answer? Yes, Freddie. Uh, Chris. I said unorthodox. Unorthodox. <laughs> Apart from orthodox. No, <laughs> oh my I, I, I said unorthodox as well, to be fair. The people that put Southpaw, you are right. Me and Freddie Brexit. Boxing brains. Which boxer has the most professional knockouts? So, this no, guy's a knockout no. artist. Mike McKinson. Not Mike McKinson. Can't be, surely. He's not professional. Can't, can't be. No, he's a bit slap. Carry on. Get this. Is he boxing or like... Which boxer has the most professional knockouts? I know, I know two. I've got two in my head. Oh, well, pick one of them. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Because I'm pretty sure one with 68 and then one with 60. Possibly. Oh, oh, mate. You know what? Freddy, what's yours? I'll put Muhammad Ali. Ellis? Oh. I forgot about him. No. Ellis, what did you Can put? Mike Tyson. Uh, Curtis. David Hay. Chris. I said Rocky Marciano. Ash. I put George Foreman. <laughs> it is in fact Billy Bird. Sorry. With a hundred thirty-eight. Knockouts. Okay. So you were close okay. with uh, 68 there, Ash, with your estimation. Well, I more. We had like 100 and something. But um, most, of his, most of his went professional. A more current question, so question three. Who is Deontay Wilder's current coach? Nonce. <laughs> Who the f*** is that guy? Who the, Who the f*** is that guy? Is that guy? Um, it's got oh, to man. be Floyd Mayweather Senior. <laughs> Um, wait, oh. maybe if I just put George Foreman for all my answers, surely one of them's got to come in. 
What's his name? Oh, f <laughs> who the f is that guy? So, uh, who is Deontay Wilder's current coach? Oh, no, because he sacked his coach, didn't he? Because he got f***ing argued with Ben, whatever his name is, and then he died and. And then told him if he really smacked him about anyway, so. Oh. I'm actually. S oh, he's English, he's English. That really narrows it down. Freddie, have you got one? Uh, I'd put, I haven't put anything, so I'm going to say Sean Raggett. Ellis. I only know this because he was the one that chucked the towel in. Ellis. Uh, Nikola Mantov. <laughs> Curtis. I'll put KSI. Chris. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my life. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad we're, we're taking this quiz really seriously, guys. Um, Ash. Mark Greenland. The man is actually called Jay Diaz. Jay Diaz. Can, I, can you Google who Mark Greenland is? Because I, I don't know why I've got Mark Greenland in my head. Whoever wants to do that after, go and do that. Uh, whose autobiography is titled... The soul of a butterfly. That's oh. easy. Um, Logan Paul. Is this question four? <laughs> this is question four. Uh, An Ensign Gibb. <laughs> JMX. He's, a, he's an American retired world championship boxer. Let's go, champ. Steven Gerrard. Really? Denver Bar. What's an Aaron? Ashley, we're going to start with you. Whose autobiography is titled The but Soul of a Butterfly? I put Muhammad Ali. Chris. Yeah, I said Ali. Curtis. Muhammad Ali. Ellis. Muhammad Ali. Freddie. Oh, it's Muhammad. A big You're all right. It is, in fact, Muhammad Ali. I'll take that before you've even said. This is the final <laughs> question. So... This is worth three points. Yeah. Oh. Three points. Now we're talking. Oh, yeah. What? For that, use the three points. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Don't cry. No, you're not, okay? It's all Southampton. My love. Hey. Killed me. This is the final question. Which boxing event sold the post pay per views of all time? Which boxing event sold the post pay per views of all time? If you get one of the boxes right, does it give you a point? No. No. But it's three yeah, points. How about one point? One point out of three. I'd points. definitely say no to that because that's unfair. Because if you get one, I could just write like two random boxes down and then. It, it says which boxing event, so you've got two fighters. Well, obviously, one with boxing. A, win, a boxing event. Yeah. Event. That is, that's, that is a boxing match. So that's two like fighters. One. Two fighters. Like well, you got to think of the other one. I can't, I can't and it's not John Marquis. Is it new? Really, that really, that really, uh, uh, relatively. Oh, what's his name? Oh, no, what's his name? It's really hard. Me. I don't know these two thought to go, uh, together, but I think I'm, I, I think I might have got it. I don't know. I've got one. I've got two actually, but there's I don't know anymore. I don't know anymore. I don't know. It's got to be KSI Logan Paul too. I mean, I yeah. It's not that. <laughs> oh, is it not? <laughs> I've got to change my answer. I've got it. <laughs> Yeah, oh, but it's, it's got to be a boxing event people take seriously. Oh, to be fair, it was a guess. <laughs> it's two oh, actual God. boxers, not professionals that are fans. They are professional boxers now, I was just saying. Yeah, oh, but... I've got two down, Sam. Before you say anything, I've got two down, but I've crossed one out. 
I've got, okay. I've, I've got, yeah, I'm taking a guess. Oh, I've crossed one down. Oh, you've just seen my bear. Oh, my Ash, what have you got then? I've got Pacquiao versus Mayweather. Chris. Yeah, I've said Mayweather, Pacquiao. Curtis. AJ Klitschko. Ellis. David Hay versus Amir Khan. And Freddie. I'll put Mayweather McGregor. The answer was Manny Pacquiao versus Floyd Mayweather. Yes! Count your points up and then we will announce them. Who is the well, first I'm winner? Be in closest to the um, when Clough got sacked. Yeah, you got that. So Ash got the 4,001 and Chris got the 46 days, but it was 44. I think I've got this in the back. So count your points up and then we'll we'll announce the first winner of the Osagovo not-so-pub quiz. I didn't get any of that, but... How many questions was that? 20. 20, isn't it? What? Mate, I've done pretty well here. I didn't think I was doing under this good. Oh, double digits. Nah. Uh, Jack Stitch is up with the questions here, massively. I'll print that. I think we should do different questions, different hosts. Yeah. yeah. I reckon I should host next on. Freddie, you can crack on. So, Ash, points. I've got 14. Chris. I've got my answers, you little prick. Chris. I've got 10. Respectable. Curtis. I've got 5. Oh, yes! Five. You got you got five at least. Freddy, did you get your five? Mine got seven. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. I'll take one wrong. So this guy's going two. places. And Ellis, the deciding man, did Ash win or are you going to overtake 14? I got six. Oh, oh Ashley. Ah. The only time Wolves have ever won anything. Congratulations. <laughs> oh, I've got to keep this in. Oh, he didn't even enjoy that. That was straight down. Another one, Ash. Another one. Yeah, go on then. Number two. This is all. Dark fruits down and challenge. Finish your fridge. <laughs> Finish your fridge and then show us after. <laughs> oh, no worries. <laughs> yeah, she will learn something. <laughs> so, wait, man. This is cool. stupid purple. I'll do a full bottle of vodka if you want. Um, I'll talk about that. You guys. crack on then, mate. <laughs> Absolute edible. Another one? Yeah, go on then. <laughs> I've got all night. I'm at work tomorrow at seven, I don't care. I've got all night. <laughs> <laughs> it's like watching a chimp eat a banana. This is for the not in Spain. year old man. <laughs> Every Friday, no, I forget the outro at the moment. I'm more interested in this.
You're still recording, aren't you, Sam? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm not missing this. I've missed the questions, but I'm not missing this. We will we will This is the weirdest experience I've ever had. Cut me out. Get me out. <laughs> Show us your fridge. Thank you to all of you and thank you for Ash for that party trick Jeez, at the end. Please like the video, please share on all social medias. Please share these boys. Actually, Ash, what's your what's your handle? It's Ashstein99. Chris. I have no idea. Give me two minutes, I'll ask the others. Curtis. I'll have to get mine up as well. Ellis. Can you share yes, Ellis? And Freddie. Uh, Freddie Buck free. We'll uh, just wait for these boys. Good. One, two, zero, zero. Curtis? Uh, Curtis P 0993990908. Yeah, no one's adding you, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go, go and follow everybody else. I'll, I'll change I'm, I'm, I'm Sam Gale 2019. Yeah. My I'm guy. Gale. And we will see you in the next one. Goodbye.